Assalamu alaikum and hi. Today we're going to be solving a question about quarks composition. Let's take a look at the question real quick. All right. A sigma plus particle has these quantum numbers strangeness negative one, charge positive one, and spin one over two. Which of the following quarks combination produces it? So, it, before we start answering the question, we have to take the information systematically. It states that it's sigma positive so a baryon so a baryon should consist of three quarks you can see the answer you can see this is not a baryon is a meson meson has quarks and anti quarks right so it's not the answer so the the charge is positive one so if you add all of these quarks it will lead to positive one charge and the spin is one over two well, basically all quarks has one over two integer the strangeness is negative one so strange so there is the strange quark here so you know that one of the quarks composition is s right so take a look at this table it says it has negative one strangeness strangeness is already negative one so there will be a strange quark here you can write s here and the other two quarks you don't know yet i write it x okay the next thing you should be considering is the charge when you add all of the charges it will become positive one so it is impossible for a quarks to be negatively charged because you want the final answer positive so the down quarks and the bottom quarks is impossible strange quark is possible because the strangeness is there so what's left is up charmed and top quark down is impossible right um oh yes this one let's see e up up this is anti strange quark so it is impossible because the strangeness is negative one so it is a strange quark not an anti strange quark so it is impossible for e to be the answer and then let's take a look at u u s or s s u it's between c or d i think d is impossible because strange is negative one try to add negative one plus negative one plus two over three it will equal to zero so d is impossible the answer is c if you want to validate your answer the charge of up quark is 2 over 3 so 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 you get it 4 over 3 and then strange quark is negative 1 over 2 4 over 3 minus 1 over 3 equals to positive 1 which is the correct answer if you want to remember quarks i have created a simple acronym so that you remember it for long term acronym for quarks you chose this don't step back repeat after me you chose this don't step back okay u for up c for charm d for top d for down s for strange b for bottom uh acronym the thing about acronyms is it makes you remember for a really long time i still remember the planet acronym the electromagnetic wave acronyms just because it's easier to remember acronym for leptons leptons and my tex e for electron m for muon d for tau and then the rest is electron neutrino muon neutrino and tau neutrino and one more thing about quarks is the first row of the quarks up charm and top it has a charge of positive 2 over 3 and the second row of the quarks down strange and bottom it has negative 1 over 3 charge yeah i hope you remember these properties of quarks is really important because you are dealing with lots of questions that will test your understanding about these quarks let's solve another questions in the next videos